So guys, for the first step, you wanna head over to search and type in manage advanced sharing settings. Click on it. And then once you're on this, we're just gonna expand private networks and all networks and public networks. And you just wanna copy everything that you see on my screen. Network discovery, turn this on. Find and printer sharing, turn this on. Network discovery on the public networks, turn this off. Find and printer sharing, turn this off. And then turn off public folder sharing. File sharing connections, 120 a bit recommended. And then password protected sharing, you're gonna turn this off. And now for the second step, you wanna head over to search and type in edit group policy. Click on it. And then once you're on this, under computer configuration, you wanna expand Windows settings. And then you wanna expand security settings. And then you wanna expand local policies. And then you wanna click on security options. And now this will come up. And then once you're on this, we're gonna scroll down till we see Microsoft. We're gonna scroll down till we see Microsoft. And you want to go to Microsoft Network Client Digitally sign communication always. Make sure that you go to client and it's not server. You're gonna to go to client. This one right here, double click on it. Make sure that you have this disabled and then click on okay. And now for the next step, you just wanna close out all of this. We're gonna de-expand all these. We're gonna close out all this. And then once we're back on this, under computer configuration, we're gonna expand administrative templates. And now we're gonna expand network. And now we're going to click on Landman Workstation. Click on this. And now you're going to double click on Enable Insecure Guest Logons. Double click on this. Make sure that you have this set to Enabled. You're probably going to have it on Not Configured. You want to set this to Enabled. And then click on OK. And now the problem should be fixed. If the problem is still not fixed though, just restart your computer. And then the problem should be fixed.